Welcome to trying to set up the internet, Emily. Everything will go completely wrong. Uh, things may fall over sideways, people may cry, and fires may start. Press start. So, welcome to episode 11 of A Shining Farce. I'm G Never Sleep 05. Below me in the camera, that way, that way, is Woodhouse 204. And aside Woodhouse 204. Boop, 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 it is boop. my daughter. Say hi, daughter. We have a youngling. Everything is working today, except oh, for the yeah. safe state. Straight the away. Everything <laughs> works straight away. Yeah. No, boy. It worked immediately there, in, was, there was no complications at all this is exactly when we wanted to start yeah we're not late starting at all no and also the save state has not saved where we saved last fight so we're gonna see as john once described it last week as a loaf of bread get punched off a cliff again yeah. <laughs> so uh are you still wanting to reenact this john or would you care to skip it skip it skip Right, uh, we're about to rock and bread roll this guy off a cliff. Yeah. Um, so this evening, we will be also having to return to doing the Bikini Bottom adventure after we fell in battle last episode. Yeah, and he did. And because the save state didn't save properly, this is from when we first did the Bestoke fights. Take three or take four of this particular fight. This will be take three of this fight. And this is fine because we have this... We do have... We've not got Tau in this group. And I'm sure we got the thick... We did get it in the other one, didn't we? So yeah. I wonder if we can use this to lure out the two uh, Pegasus flyers up oh, at the, the north. Archers. Yeah, no, not the archers. These Pegasus knights. Oh, yeah. If you remember last time, when we got to a certain distance, they aggressively came out, uh, which made you create a series of common comments <laughs> about that. Um, and here we are. What have you done this week, John, or since last night's uh, intrigue? Hang on, wait. Do we have power spears? After last week, I dropped oh them. Please, please say you got power spears. A quick. Don't drop. Don't drop them. I've got them. I've got them, fam. Okay. Um, so we've got so many archers, but they're not as well leveled as they were <laughs> last week. <laughs> Everything's... Yeah. If there's one thing that happens when we do these series and you sometimes use this method of uh, playing a game, is the ability to go sideways is equally as available as the ability to go forward. Um, yeah. I so we're just here enjoying everything and doing our best, making the best of these terrible, terrible situations. Pretty much. I don't know. Um, I, how do you feel like the, this experience has gone so far? Uh, like for, the whole like Shining Force 1 experience? I've enjoyed it, even if it has been difficult and things have gone sideways. Um... But for me, there's been like a lot of interesting learning curves. Like uh, in this series, I'm doing the playing. Uh, you asked me to do some of the editing and the downloads. So I'm taking a little bit more responsibility, which for me is uh, interesting. So you uh, get to see the other side of it, right? Yeah. Uh, I, how how yeah. do you feel about that? I kind of sometimes I'm trying to f make time, more time. Uh, to do things and also being able to do things like see my girlfriend and spend time with my son and well you see you should multitask like I do because yeah I, I just this is this is family time it is I now streaming time yo big up the fam so the thing that's annoying is this Anri isn't as good as last week's Anri last week's last week's Anri I think so, we're actually going to know what that means. So, are you actually going to put on the previous attempt? Yeah. I'm going to pop on the previous attempt, and then obviously the big reveal of the sideways will come in episode 
11. This will be episode 11. Yeah. Um, so I might be doing some, like, less edited versions just to try and catch up on the cycle from when I've come back on holiday and with summer holidays and all that jazz. Just... Yeah. I was like, going to say, because like, we're, we're still recovering after being on holiday for a yeah. week. As well as Gareth's, like, um, interesting internet connection. Yeah. Um, it was weird how I literally sort of had to turn off my laptop and I had to resequence the way I opened computer programs for stuff to work. But we made it. We got here. Um, I also today... Funny you should mention computer problems... Uh, yeah. Hopefully, in the near future. Ooh, super hands. Nice. 14. Uh, we. Or we. I have uh, spent a small uh, fortune to acquire the parts to build my first internet machine. Yay! Uh, the thing that is upsetting is if I bought them yesterday. They would have, in total, it would have saved me about forty-five pounds, uh, because all the parts on a number of websites went up this morning. Uh, yeah, did you do that? And that was just really frustrating because when I had, I had them. It, the biggest uh, annoyance with that was somebody got hurt, didn't they? Was it May? No, Gort. Um. The biggest uh, contributor to my financial downfall was Jeff Bezos. And after last week, I had to pray for to him for fine interconnect internet connection and the stability to make this happen. He betrayed me! He betrayed you from his giant uh, space laser in the sky. His Dr. Evil spaceship. Yes. Uh, the Bezos space station. Is that- is- when's that happening? It's just a giant bald head, like, <laughs> like the film Megamind. <laughs> right, hang on, how far? I, I, I'd have preferred it if it was more just like... It's just a, like the gaping, smiling face of Jeff orbiting the space... Orbiting Earth, just like this massive... Smug grin on his face. How far do they go? Seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Because these guys... Well, technically, hit. they should be attacking your guys already. Yeah. Well, let's let's offer one of the birdie boys. Just and, so you can get the item, right? Yeah. Because what we can always do... I'm still unsure, because last week someone was telling me that you can't look at that item on the floor. And I feel you should be able to? What do you mean? Well, hang on. Let me just reverse court. Put him in reverse. Uh, like, there's a square underneath it and a square to the side. It's not... Um, yeah. Like, you, you, you are capable of facing that from... Yeah, you should be able to search without having a flying unit, yeah. is what you're telling me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, like, it's going to be really hard to get someone all, all the way, way around. It should be possible. Um, so last week, where did we leave? Did we get shot at the top? Yes. Somebody got shot at the top. Just rude. Indeed. Uh, let's put Gort there and see if we can encourage some some people to take pot shots from willy-nilly positions and hope that it all goes. How would you like to say it, John? Oh, we missed. Kaijo Blue. Oh, Kaijo nice. Blue. Balbury not just dying straight away to a stranger. No, I'm surprised. Oh, you did get the Pegasus Knight to come forward as well. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Peralta time, baby. Yeah. Um, so, after after discussing uh, the poopy stream that happened last night where we played yeah. some Dark Date and... Uh, and that, ga that, ga that game ran as well as set up tonight. Oh, but yeah. I didn't just, like, turn my computer on and just go, click... We're right on. Because um, that's what you did, isn't it, Gareth? Yeah, exactly. Like, 100%. That's yeah. how that's how my life and technology runs, yeah? Just mm -hmm. 100%. Mm -hmm. Just smooth. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that, so we did a stream last night. It, it went poorly. Uh, the game was very buggy. And um, 
it Given seems that nobody's really interested in Dark Deity anymore, so we're going to try something else. Um, and I've kind of, after discussing it on our Discord, which uh, I'll put up in a sec. And I'll put um, in the video descriptions. Yeah. Balbury's um, dead. Oh, yeah, super. Oh, my God. Wait, what? What's going on? Gordon, he's alive! Uh, have you pre have you done like the the old Doom IDD QD? What well, yeah. what's going on? Like, I don't know. I I'm, I'm 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 taking what I can get here, John. Oh yeah. But yeah, uh, after discussing it on the Discord, I'm torn. I'm now officially torn between two particular series. Are you Natalie and Brolio? That I would like to take a look at. And um, what are they? I my first choice would be Suikoden. Yeah. The classic uh, Konami series starting in the late 90s. Yeah. The second choice would be... Suikoden Legend. <laughs> <laughs> no, it would be um, the Legend of Heroes series. Right. Um, so my game experience of those is I've played... In, in fact, I've played the first game of both of those. Yeah. In Australia, are the Legend of Heroes games called Legend of What a Bloomin' Hero? No, but I feel like they should be. Like, that that's the vibe I'm getting, is... It's actually kind of serious, though. Like, it, it there's, there's some... The, the games so far... So I've only played the first one, which is Trails yeah. in the Sky, um, which has a, 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 a questionable acronym, if you think about it. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> uh, it's very well written. It's extremely well written. I, I, I enjoyed the story in that very much so. Um, so, the only thing I can think of if I was to replay that particular first game again, yeah. to get your opinion on it, um, would be trying to complete it without losing. Now, if you do that, you get um, some special weapons for the two main characters. Right. Um, which uh, seems pretty cool. Um uh Whenever people say cool at the moment, have you seen the Transformers with Anthony Hopkins in it? No. And he goes, kind of cool, dude, in a really weird, creepy fashion. Yeah. No, I have not seen that. Yeah, it's all that's been stuck in my head for like two days. Uh, what a wonderful, wonderful mind you have, Gareth. <laughs> it's not much of a mind, but it's all mine. So let's see what happens here. I'm trying to go through the turn cycle to get the laser eye to attack. Is Balbury going to die? Is he dead? He's dodged three times in a row. Have oh my we God, what's going on? Have we summoned the crit gods? Have we just been like, guys, oh, hello. Oh, dog attack. Damn. Dog raid. Wait, you've been attacked by your dog? He's just come running upstairs because he heard me getting excited. Oh, okay. <laughs> and he's not had a walk yet, so he's like, Yes! Excitement must mean we're going somewhere! Alright, is he getting walkies after this? Yeah. Uh, I think Chris has just finished his tea, and he's awaiting for the digestion process to finish. And then, a small doge walk may occur. I see. But yeah, um, so... Yes, the uh, Trails in the Sky... The first chapter, as it's known among its fans, is uh, I've completed it. Yeah, completed um, it, mate. I, I feel like there are multiple endings or something, and I didn't get the best one. I I feel like that's right, yeah. but I'm not sure. Um, a game that I know to have multiple endings is Suikoden 1. Yes. Which I have... This yeah. is just an excuse for John to show his collection of classic uh, RPG games. I mean, I have most of the best ones on John, the PlayStation 1. John's just there like, Ooh, look at, look at these biceps! These RPG biceps! <laughs> so strong, I mean... <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> that, that subtle flex that's going on. Hey, I mean, the only one that I'm missing out of the European area that I don't have that is it's sweeter in two because I'm not paying like 200 pounds how's we lost hands 
Wow, a stunning attack of 16 killed hands where he stood. Like, what, what do you think about this, Emily, by the way? what Do you, do you <sighs> think this looks interesting? Or do you think it looks like... <sighs> like a, a Fisher-Price game gone wrong? How dare you, <laughs> sir? How dare you? <laughs> you gotta admit, like, for, for someone that's grown up in this generation, like, this has got to be fairly primitive, right? It, it, it's good. It's good? You think it's good? Well, allow me to disappoint you. I say... Oh, wow. I'm re-inflicting one point of damage there. Like I say, allow me to disappoint you, Emily, with this character's muscular bird arms. Yeah. Uh, as my, made out of twigs. As my dad yeah. famously said. Yeah. Uh, my dad once famously commented, uh, he's got muscles like a sparrow's kneecap. Yep. Uh, the sparrow has no knees. Yeah. So. Uh, right. And that's how my dad would describe me to strangers. Big shout outs to my dad. <laughs> Big shout outs. Massive follower yeah. in the uh, the chat there every week yeah. is yeah. your dad. Big support from uh, Big Brian. Yeah. Big Daddy O. Yeah. Always there supporting supporting us in our endeavors yeah. online. I actually had to explain to my dad what a meme was the other day. Oh, a meme. And then, and he, a it was basically a meme. -y. Well, no, it was a meme. -y. What are these memes I, about that everyone keeps talking Eric, what about? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, she only has Blaze 1, doesn't she? Because she I didn't she level up. Two. We yeah. didn't level... Can she actually go... So, I remember actually having a an adult conversation with somebody who I didn't know particularly well, who called them Maymays. Yeah. Is this like my, fa my dad also calls to... Chavs Shavs? Yeah, but she was like 20. Yeah. She's 20 years old and called them Maymays. There we go, we've like, got Blaze 2 now, we've crossed the bridge. Yeah. Even I know what they are. Memes. My son is obsessed with Hollow Knight memes, especially in video format. Eh. He'll get over that, it's just a phase. John, don't you not still make memes? For general consumption of the public. Occasionally, when, when the uh, the mood strikes me. Like the uh, infamous Lion King alteration to the Anakin meme. I I actually think that's superior to the original, yeah. <laughs> Your own toughest critic as well, John. We I... could get defeated on this map a second time, or because we had to go get the bikini. I mean, that's not the worst thing, because you can start with the bikini. Yeah. Bikini. And also, yeah. I can start bikini. with Tau. That's why I named the stream the Bikini Bottom Experience. Uh, I actually did wonder when we were setting up because I did call it something like the Bikini Bandits initially on stream. Yeah. And uh, I was worried that the uh, Twitch police may not have appreciated that name or it may have had connotations beyond the, the ones I had made. <laughs> and uh, uh, the purple... Oh, you missed out. You missed out. Come on. When I say whoop whoop, you you know what to do, don't you, Gareth? But sounds of the police. There we go. You didn't do it. How dare you not under? You're supposed to know this. You're my child. <laughs> Have all I've got in my head is the Adam and Joe show with the uh, good police are good to me. The good police. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know what it is, and you know what when he picks up his um, how does he describe him? Oh, I'm just picking up my uh, stepson. Well, and you know what it means today, Timmy? That's right, it's Tuesday, meaning it's NWA day in the car. Oh, please, James, don't play the tape. It's okay, I fixed it. Whoop, whoop, it's the sound of the police. Because good, good police are good to me. Whoop. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that. That was on, um, he did that bit on 8 out of 10 cats, didn't he? It's a great bit. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that that lives in my head rent free, and I can think I cannot think of anything else that you would rather uh, allow to uh, live in your brain space. So my you... wife was telling me about this um, this guy that she follows on TikTok. Uh, TikTok and, uh, don't start. There, there are many issues with that to begin with. Yeah. But this particular guy is an American who loves to have English things to eat and drink. Okay, um, I think I've seen this guy. Is he kind of a bit redneckish? I don't 
right now? Uh, I don't think so. There's a guy and he sounds sort of sadly a little bit stereotypical redneck. And then I just remember him eating something and he's like, you Brits eat this? <laughs> no, it's not that, that guy. No, he, he has... What, what's his phrase? Do you remember what his catchphrase is? Give me all your money. <laughs> no, it, it was... Um, like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> I, I think it might be something... It's something stereotypically British. So an American guy going, cool, blimey, when, when he has something good. I always find it funny. Uh, yes, May. I'm about that. Um, there's a guy who does uh, Duel Link stuff, Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links, which is the mobile app game. And he occasionally just shouts in a very bad British accent, Yes, mate! <laughs> and also uses the phrase, Mad Lad. And when I hear him say oh, the goodness. phrase, Mad Lad, something is about he also, it... Is, it... is he one of those guys that also goes, Techers? No. Um, he is famous scenes. for... Absolute scenes. <sighs> Unbelievable, Jeff. <laughs> um, it's a bad name. There's an amazing uh, moment when Liverpool FC signed a, a left-back called Alberto Moreno. And they were like, oh, he's, his agent had been like, oh, yeah. his agent had bigged him up. And he'd said, um, oh, Alberto's made for the English game. And it's like, what makes you think that? And uh, Alberto Moreno lent into the microphone and pretended to do his uh, best uh, Chris Kamara impression going, Unbeli Please. Unbelievable, Jeff. He also made himself popular with your old team supporters as well. Cheese. 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 Pet petrol. Cheese. Cheese. Petrol. Cheese. Cheese. <laughs> Another Mitch the Red scene. <laughs> nobody apart from us is going to understand. Petrol. You'll cheese. There's no cheese here. Petrol. <laughs> You've covered yourself in cheese, you daft so and so. <laughs> yep. Cheese. There you go. Lowe's leveling up. Are you feeling tired now? No. No. <laughs> Have you. I could run across the whole field. The whole I could. I across this bridge? Yes. Yeah? Do you think you could? Maybe you could distract the lazy eye with your bridge running. Yeah, you see the lazy eye? Who's the lazy eye? The lazy eye, it fires its laser. People. This is the lazy eye. There you go. Lazy it, eye. Or me and your dad might call it Dominic Cummings. Oh, <laughs> witty, witty. Too late, Gareth. Too late. That's so 2020. Uh, <laughs> you understood what I was going for there. Yeah. What, Christopher Witty? There you go. The, the bad healers have leveled up while holding the... Is it me or does the power staff look suspiciously like a bouquet of flowers? Go. Oh. <sighs> Lazy eye. Lazy <laughs> eye. <laughs> That's a way to go. Okay. Yeah. That's the uh. lazy eye. Bit nice, mate. Well, mate. Mate's actually doing... Good stuff. I think she got quite a, a decent strength increase on the uh, level up. Yeah, I guess so. Barbara's just hanging out. Yeah. Just Chilling. flapping. Like a villain. Yeah. Chilling. As I jokingly said after England lost to Italy in the Euros final, Chil uh, Cellini like a Vellini. That's terrible. Well done. You're welcome. I'm here all week, or for at least the rest of the stream, when everything's gone sideways. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I, I, I said you were going to lose. I mean, you're doing okay now. Yeah. Even with uh, a team of terrible bird people. <laughs> Yay! No love lost. Not showing, Yay. not showing off the Xylof abilities. Oh. Yeah, that's because you messed up though, wasn't yeah. it? We've still got Xylo. Oh, we're not going to get Kikichi now on this run. So I'd actually have to aggress. Oh, God. Run away and come back. No. No. But I Is want, it worth it, Gareth? I want all the characters. 
So you're gonna do it then? I'm gonna quickly do it now that I've remembered. Ah. Uh, but then, John, we've got yeah. all. I, I can save it quickly, and we'll have all the sweet stuff. John's like, oh, John, you made me sit through that Vesta fight last night in Dark Deity, <laughs> which is I didn't eight. Have a choice. I was going as fast as I could. That game. That. I, that map was the longest eight turns I can remember in any turn based It, it on. was kind of long-winded, wasn't it? Unnecessarily so, some would say. What? No, no, what, what are you doing? I'm trying to... If I'm going to aggress when I get to... Yeah, he could have killed the... Oh, never mind. It's all right. Balbury, Balbury's fle uh, flexing as well now. Okay, I was going to say that, that uh, mage guy only had four health. Why didn't you kill him? Because apparently, I always believed in the heart of the cards, John. And Ugh. I knew. Ugh. Ugh. The heart of the cards. Who was yelling that about every 30 seconds last night? Hi, my name is John. And you activated I'm my trap cards. I'm a YouTuber. And I make things that are terrible. And force people to watch them at my life. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I've got a release schedule. Maybe I don't. <laughs> Oh, I've been really scheduled. I actually keep to it. Yeah. Ooh. Meow. Oh, no, he didn't. Emily, can you do me a favor? Can you go into the kitchen and get a saucer and some milk for your dad, please? That's He's actually going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> no. It, no, I don't need water. Are you worried you're no, going to get... No, I don't want you to throw it in my face. Are you worried you're going to have a little bit of uh, cream in your whiskers, John? I have a milkshake every morning, by the way, for the extra protein. I'm on that. Uh, like <laughs> somebody came up to me this morning. Like I get a little bo a little bottle of um, I think it's called Ufit. Ufit <laughs> yes, yeah. uh, milkshake. Yeah, yeah. That's got protein in it. And he goes, uh, he was walking past and he stopped and he looked at it and he went, "What?" And I said, "You're right, mate." Yeah, and he goes. Why are you drinking unfit? <laughs> you, you're already unfit. You don't need to drink anything to get that. Was he trying to be funny? I think he's trying to be funny, but I was just like, mate, I, I know. I know I'm unfit. Thank you for pointing that out. Please move along. Mm. Scooch move along. along. Yes. Right. Scooch along. These aren't the jokes you're looking for. Move along. Move along. Right. Oh, Nova. Well, Grumps, are you ready to face the enemy? We're not yeah. having... I like this music. Uh, so... Who are we leaving behind, John? I wonder Everybody. who we could leave. We're marching forwards into the distance. I'm on. Get to the back of the bus. Um, Tau. Sweet, gentle Tau. Yes. So, are we are we ditching Ken in this force for May and Arthur? I mean, they, May and Arthur seem to be dealing dealing good damage now. Yeah. So, so you've put Zylo in now, have you? Yep. Let's just get the right. little, the team photo. It still looks like those archers are playing with like hockey sticks instead of bows. Yeah, the Casey Jones squad. Yeah. Uh. Give. So that goes to where's tower? There you go, tower. More item exchange. Good times. Uh, where is it? Uh, give. One of the burbs has it. There you go. There's something very strange about the outfit in that image. Yeah, it's it's odd. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you'll see what I mean in a sec. It looks like they're made out of just ice cream sticks. Yeah. They just uh, have bottoms, but no tops. Hang on. No. Do I have to... I, I think you have to leave the, the place to make it work. And then go back. Yeah. Because it also changes the positions. There, there go. we go. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I didn't realize how. What do you mean? They, like... Look like, they look like somebody's got two ice creams, <laughs> got the little little sticks, and just stuck them together. It looks terrible, doesn't it? That's... 
so big. <laughs> The thing that it, it makes Anri's head you look like... You need to go like... do the Kikichi thing, Gareth. You're yeah, going the wrong uh, way. yeah, yeah. I just realised it was like, this is the wrong door. Yes. And wrong. now I'm like... Wrong, wrong. That's, that's also, also the wrong, wrong door. door. It's in the bottom left. Yeah. Boo, ba -doo, ba -doo, ba -doo. This, I, I mean, you. this, this that, is not the this fourth is time the... you've done this. No, that's... Keep going down again. Uh, down, down, down. Down to the left. Uh... There you go. Down. The suspected Kikichi's Down. wife. Hello. What are you doing? Don't touch anything, you meddler. <laughs> that Kikichi... My Kikichi voice sounded a bit like Kikichi from Spirit of the Way. Mm, it sounded a lot like Nova. Did it. You in town, eh? Go out back and I'll show you my latest invention. Mustache twirl. <laughs> Look at this bit. You'll like this bit. I can actually do that. What? One, I can twirl one side of my mustache really well. Like, but the other side just goes down more than sideways. Watch carefully. Okay. Here I go. Good luck, Kikichi. Meow. <laughs> flap, 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 flap. <laughs> Flap, 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 flap. Oh no. Well, it didn't work this time either. Oh no. What's the name of that character from Vandal Hearts that's like that? Darius. Darius, yes. Another failure. I'm starting to think Akichi should just give up. Hey, don't give up on your dreams. That's right. If you can if dream, if you can Darius dream it, you like can meme was... it. Darius just looks like one of the characters out of the the old bit. Did you ever play the the old Bitmap Brothers game Chaos Engine? No, I'm aware of it. It was oh, like okay. there was a lot of hype for it, wasn't there? When we were young. Yeah. When we were young. Yes, yes, there was. We need to go find him. Is there anything actually through here? No. Nope. Disappointment. That's what's through here. Nothing is found. Yep. As it's is tradition. Ba 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 ba. To the bridge. bridge. I've not bought any healing items, so this will only go well. Oh yeah. Uh, another lazy eye. Yeah. Oh, in fact, the same lazy eye. Warm up sequence initiated. Ten, nine, eight, kebabs. So much. Oh, look, look at the state of that. Underwater kebabs. <laughs> Underwater kebabs. The state of that. Oh my god. Her hips are just swaying. And Hips just... don't lie. <laughs> Maybe she was the influence for uh, pop songstress Shakira. Shakira, Shakira. Have you ever heard, with Shakira being mentioned, have you ever heard of the band Enter Shikari? Yeah. Many, many moons ago, I went to see Enter Shikari. No, well, I didn't. Story. Yeah. What stories? Yeah. No, this, this is the key for us to fall asleep. Yeah. During the show, uh, I'd actually gone to the gig to watch a friend's band, and everyone, as soon as Enter Shikari were going to enter the come onto stage, everyone r r like rushed back into the room, ready to go. And I was like, I've never heard of this band. Are they good? And the bass, my friend who was the bass player, was like, Oh yeah, they're pre they're going to be pretty big. I think they're going to do all right. And then they played the is it Sorry I'm Not a Winner, the name of the song. Uh, which infamously ha has the riff and everyone in the room clapped at exactly the same time in the same formation and it was one of the creepiest experiences of my life oh so they did the um the iceland uh, thunderclap yes right, before the iceland thunderclap and obviously much more jauntier I, I would there's put nothing jaunt. There, there's not the Iceland thunderclap is jaunty. What are you talking about? Oof! 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 Luke! 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 No! 
Oh my god! Luke, no indeed! I, I Actually, I don't understand why you kept Luke in. Because he's been disappointing. Do you disappointing reckon? You've already been nothing. Luke has been the Yaha we expected in War of the Gods. Yaha. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Without oh. being... There she moves again. Twerking her way to I victory. It. <laughs> Work it. Work it, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Don't stop it. This is a family friendly show. <laughs> so, you're reckoning what? Get rid of Luke, put Ken back in for the next fight. Possibly. Okay. Are we keeping with? Are we keeping the Twiglet twins? <laughs> them two, the freak shows. Of, I, I, that, that's unfair. I shouldn't call them freak shows. They're freaks of nature. <laughs> they might not have a show. We may be the vehicle for their popularity. Who knows? Maybe. What are they even for? What are they even for? I. They're meant to look good. Is that their only purpose? Yeah. They, they, they don't attack. No, they, they do. No, one, they, they, two, they attack three, and everything. Four. It's just that the the outfits that they changed into are supposed to look good. Yeah. Okay, but um, if they don't look good. No, Unfortunately, not. Yeah. Unfortunately, Emily, what looks good in 1991 may not age very well in uh, 2021. <laughs> okay. Results may vary from generation to generation. Yeah. Like, some people don't like this version of this game, and I enjoy it because it reminds me of my childhood, because I'd have been about your age when I played this, having borrowed it from someone. And uh, then... And I didn't play it that age, I played it much later. Yeah. In fact, you were alive when I played this for the first time. I was alive, was I, baby? You were a tiny wee baba. I, I was yeah. half expecting this to suddenly turn into another reference for John uh, to talk about Short Circuit. Emily no, no. was alive. No. Question, Short Circuit 1 or Short Circuit 2, which do you prefer? Um, ending to Short Circuit 2, very good. Yeah. The rest of Short Circuit 2, not very good. <laughs> Absolutely dire. Um, I, I had I mean, an experience... You, you can... Who can uh, question uh, some Bonnie Tyler, um, really, at the end of any film? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, this could be bad for Henry. And you'll notice, by the way, she doesn't wear a bikini it, there. It, it, do it was because they got a stunning attack on her. Oh, we're going to say bye-bye to Emily. It's time for his bedtime. Okay. Bye, bye, Emily. It's boudoir o'clock, is it? Night-night. Yes, to upstairs land. <laughs> Yeah. To bedtime man. To bedtime yeah. man. To dreamy, bye -bye. sleepy, nighty, snoozy, snooze. <sighs> now for John to. And all the space is mine again. <laughs> the joy. I'm all the space. See, for some people who don't really watch it or like, watch us, and you don't have the joys of children. This is the stuff that you've got to do as a parent, you know, encourage the classics upon your children. Yep. Thru you've got to create the... And uh, show them how wrong they were. Yeah. Like, how, how awful, awful mistakes were made, and how progress is made. Yep. The roads to improvement. <laughs> doing one out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh Why my. does my goat have such low attack? Um, he was just vibing that way. Um, yeah. I, th I think one of Gort's uh, kind of issues have been getting to people. Uh, also, weapon upgrades. He hasn't yeah. had a weapon upgrade in ages. Yeah. He's still using a middle spoon. That's true. Oh, actually, I forgot to check to see if they got an axe upgrade. It, yeah, it yeah. might be, actually. It, they might be due oh, a, co a couple Zylo of... has nothing, so, I mean, he, yeah. he doesn't need anything, though. He's yeah. just, like, excellent to begin with. Uh... Wolf boys, best boys, is my argument, and I'm sticking to it. I mean, in this game, definitely. In Shadow Force 2, nah, it's yeah. Slade. Uh, I mean, one of the things, sometimes, that this is what I was saying in the stream last week, is sometimes you just get, like, the right RNG 
And because it's a rubber band RNG that leads to the same stats at the end, um, it doesn't necessarily mean you're going to have the same experience. I've had it where, like, uh, Ken has been absolutely unreal, but then his promote was absolutely dire. Um, I'm still yet to decide if I'm going to upset people and just promote everyone at level 10. I think you should. I think th this is totally the sort of thing where... You yeah. know, you should just upset as many yeah. people as possible because that is fun. But it yeah. isn't for nobody else. Yeah. I mean, that's true. That It would be like having a late bloomer when the all the stats kind of catch up. Yeah. But you've got to carry them until then, yeah. which kind of sucks. And that's that's how this game kind of works for the variants. I'm, I'm just having one of these turns where I'm just waiting for the lazy eye to fire. Uh, Gamer uh, Game Bowie says uh, making the game more challenging on stream might be less upsetting than you think. Lol. Uh, well, if you want challenging, I'm I'm considering playing the Game Boy Adva uh, Game Boy Game Gear <laughs> versions of Shining I, Force I think, after I think this. The most, I think the most challenging part of this uh, entire process is you actually getting the stream started, Gareth. Yeah. The most challenging part of this process is me. I'm challenged e any day, every that. day. Yeah. I mean, technically, I'm recording me being challenged right now. I, I do it all the time. Very true. Why is the lazy eye not going? I, I, I feel like last week when we were doing this, the lazy eye had a turn like every three seconds. And tonight, it's like, eh, just it's not. the next turn. Yeah. A little part of me kind of wishes we'd kept the um, bird boys in to encourage... What, to get things moving? Yeah. Because at the moment you can't do Jack, can you? Yeah. That's enough advertising for Jackbox, thank you. I have a surprise oh. for people on our uh, Discord tomorrow. I'm going to do something that is going to blow your mind. As long as you're keeping your trousers on and your shirt on, everyone will be happy. I definitely. Yeah. So, John, I, I, I think I think you should look forward to it, Gareth. I think you, in particular, are going to enjoy it. Is it you I, printing out Dark Deity onto a physical copy disc and then firing a shotgun at it repeatedly? <laughs> <I wish laughs> or slow uh, motion it, beating it up, Stewie Griffin style, after how it was not, last night? It's not quite that spectacular, but I think I think some enjoyment will be had from it. Yeah. Oh, that's all I'm going to say. It's going to be one of those things you're just going to have to, you know, wait until tomorrow to find out yeah. what it is. I'm curious. I mean, tomorrow I've actually ordered all my PC parts, bar the CPU, and they're all turning up at my parents' house tomorrow to make sure that somebody is in to receive them. <laughs> what a good boy you are, man. If all my customers did that, I'd be super happy. Um, also, the fact that I spent... I was willing to pay nearly £800 to buy a pre-built PC, and John was very angry at this. Yep, it's a waste uh, of money. I've spent uh, sorry, £405 on parts. I think, I think even you, Gareth, with your Fisher-Price education, will admit... I went to the like same school as you! <laughs> I never said that I did not also have a Fisher-Price education. All I'm saying is that you have a Fisher-Price education, and even you can figure out that that is less than the £800 you were quoted for making a pre-built yeah. uh, computer. Yeah, but now if anything goes wrong, it's all on me, baby. <laughs> no, all the parts come with a 12-month warranty. Oh, but I'm sure I can find new exciting ways to make it all fall down. As long as you do better than I did when I first tried to put my first PC together. When I tried to do that, I didn't realise that... Um, so... The PC case that I had needed risers, right, uh, off the uh, the bottom of it. So I just attach the motherboard to the side of the case, to the bottom of the case. And as soon as I tried to turn it on, I shorted the case. Yeah. And I shorted the motherboard and just destroyed it immediately. Destroyed everything. Oh yeah, it just melted everything. Well, it didn't melt it literally. It just shorted it. It wasn't. It ran an electrical current through what where it wasn't supposed to go. Yeah. And just destroyed all the components on it i believe so, that everything comes with the relevant hang risers on. Hang, hang on so that was not my pc it was my mother-in-law's pc 
so after I destroyed this PC, I then had to go to her and say, I'm very sorry, I've destroyed your PC. <laughs> Can you give me some money to get more parts? <laughs> to destroy more things! Yeah. So, yeah, that, that was that was an awkward conversation. Yeah. Um, especially since, like, at this point, I'd only known them for, like, a year, I think. So I was still I was still like my wife's boyfriend at that point. Yeah. You know, I wasn't I wasn't like part of the family of it then. Oh god damn it, May. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um Yeah, so that was interesting. How to make friends and influence people in the uh, name of the book slash film. God Zylo. Um, Zylo's not Simon Peg thing, yeah. right? Uh, isn't that not how to lose friends and, and something else, which was like a parody of how to make friends and influence people? Oh, is it? Oh, isn't I, it how to lose friends and alienate people? That's the one. That's what I was thinking Come. of. Wow, this, this save file compared to what we had last week is absolutely... Oh, is this going to be a juicy Blaze 2 attack here? It is going to be a big old Blaze 2. It, Although you can only get like in her sexy it, outfit, <laughs> sexing it up. She can only get forty-eight uh, XP though, can't she? I think so. And that's the maximum you're allowed. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. There, it, there it is. For that amazing like Blaze Two attack that like nearly took out three people. There are eh, forty-eight experience. <laughs> it's not like you know a, a very like you know good thing. It's not like uh, we're playing Overwatch and that was play of the game. Yeah. And everyone's like, oh wow. She Tao did very good there. That, that was amazing. She should get more experience for that. No, she just gets yeah. the flat experience that you get from yeah. defeating one person. Yeah. I mean, one of the or problems... Even 23. Yeah. Like, what the heck is that all about? Well, that's what I was just about to say, is Gamer Bowie going on about um, Gort's attack rate, and he's also at a weird point where his attack rate isn't really going up, uh, and his XP level is, like, leveled off because of where he is. Yeah. Which is making him difficult. Whereas in the previous save, which we had last week, everything was going smooth. Big hits from Tao. Big hits from well, Gort. You, you say you say everything was going smooth. Didn't didn't Grumps die? He may have died. There may have been he a little bit died. of die, a little bit of death. Yeah. Just just a smidgen. A smidgen. A, <laughs> a, a dash of death. Um. That's more like a dash to the toilet when I say it that way, isn't it? Like, I, I was in a little bit of a rush. To be fair, though, Grumps did get a heavy attack, and then it was like we were just a, No one was hitting, if you remember. Like, every, unlike this week, where Balbury amazingly invaded three times in a, a row, everyone just got dodged. Go on, go. Oh, yeah, there's no counterattacks in this, so I don't know why I'm... Nope. No. No. <laughs> Why am I getting so excited for something that will never happen? I saw something quite interesting recently, by the way. Uh, I think it might have just hit today. Right. There is a new mod out for Shining Streets of Rage 2. Okay. And do you know what it is? Is it Streets of Rage 4? No. <laughs> no. It's a level editor. Okay. It, Streets of Rage meets Mario Maker. Yeah, so you can make your own levels on it, which I think could be interesting. Although I, I don't know how um, sort of like in depth you can get with it. I'm not sure if you can like do you know uh, stitch two sections together or yeah, you know stuff like that. But yeah, it, it potentially could be very interesting, like designing your own stuff. I was thinking, me and you should uh, maybe do a stream where we play Streets of Rage uh, 4. Yeah, totally. And um, I might try it with the arcade stick, actually. Yeah? Oh, goody, so you can get all clicky. Yeah. Clicky, also... Click, 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 I actually think Estelle, for the way that her combos work, I think a joystick would work really well. Yeah. Yeah. You're probably right. Especially seeing as, like, you can just wall bounce people for days. Like, I've what's, not... What's what's the name of that um, that type of controller, by the way, that uh, doesn't have a stick, it just has buttons? A hitbox. Well... Yeah? yeah? Have you ever used one of those? No. Um, 
I've seen someone who you. Uh, I've got a friend who uses one. You got a friend? I have. A, I have other friends, John. I'm sorry to disappoint you. Um, what but, is this? Well, okay. So a little bit of context for some people who will be watching this. I used to run a a uh, oh, FC. Story, guys. <laughs> yeah. I used to run a RPG, uh, an RPG, an FGC uh, arcade night in Lancaster. And one of the guys turned up with a hitbox. And he was like, everyone should try it. It's so much better than stick. And everyone was like, I, I, my brain does not compute with this. Did everyone just destroy him? No, he destroyed everyone. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Like the people who play those things like get in there. They're getting very granular and it's like down to button choices as well. Uh, oh, so you can you can swap them out like uh, cherries and what? Yeah, yeah. Have you. There's different like, like Samwar and Sumetsu and like the two big companies. I think yeah. I've heard of them. Yeah, I, I used to own an arcade cabinet. So I know. I, uh, I I own two. Both of them were bad choices, by the yeah. way. <laughs> I sold both of them. Yeah, because they were just like, I do not have the space for this. <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> I have made some choices and I regret them all. <laughs> yeah. I certainly did. I mean, that's what life is, is right? It's like everything's a point of experience. Pretty much. Is that what you say to, to people that buy, like, you know, flashy uh, sports cars and drive them at 300 miles per hour? No, I just laugh at them. Well, actually, I probably wouldn't laugh at them because they would just be immediately dead. Is this going to be... <laughs> I mean, I, I was maybe exaggerating <laughs> slightly with the speed there, but yeah. I mean, the noise that they make certainly does make it sound like they're driving 300 miles, miles per hour. I do love the uh, the joys of the Doppler effect, yes. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm trying yeah, to work out which is safer, the... up the top or down the bottom? Down the bottom? Well, that, that space is safe because the archers can't get you. Like, he can get attacked with one archer. Once. Yeah. yeah. This is turning into last night's Dark Deity stream all over again. Why? Ah. Why? <laughs> I, I'm i very confused. It's like they're the... Uh, what, what, what's the name of the, the angry guys in the Muppet show? You know, the, uh, Statler um, and Waldorf. Yeah, the Waldorf uh, brothers. Like they're, they're just like, I can't see anything anymore. No, 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 let's change seats. Let's change seats. No, oh, they don't even do that. It's like, it ain't half bad. It ain't half good either. <laughs> that's that's, the, that's the kind of uh, thing they're doing. I'm thinking of leaving, but then your wife's at home. You're right. I should stay. That's the level of humor that would have happened in the 1970s. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. That sounds like it should be a Rodney Dangerfield <laughs> joke. I can't do a Rodgy Dangerfield voice. A Rodgy? A, a Rodgy. A Rodney. I, I can't so, do a Rodgy very well either, to be fair. I, I will tell you a little... That's what all his friends call him. I, I will regale with another Rodgy. story. Uh, today I burnt my tongue at work after being asked... Oh, hands, get in there. Uh, did, did Rodgy famously burn his tongue? Is that is that why you're no. making this connection? No. It's with me being unable to pronounce things like I usually know I can... I've burnt my tongue after someone offered me their hot sausage to try. Um, and you the... want me to say it? You want me <laughs> to say it, don't you? I may be trying to see how far I... God damn it, Grumps! <laughs> That's two in a row. Two in a row, guys. He's not hit anything. Can I right. see three? Can I see three in a row from Grumps? Right. What May. are you doing? Like, it's maybe just like... Oh, okay. She's finally finishing off Danny Elfman. Yeah. Danny Elfman. Yep. It, so does that make the lizard Tim Burton? Ooh, yes, I guess it does, yes. Oh, it's not bad, that, is it? Yeah. Lizard Tim uh, Tim Burton. Yeah. Uh, it's how Tim Burton would like it. it probably, yeah. yeah. I imagine that would be his uh, source of direction. But yeah, I, I burnt my tongue at work because we got some uh, new types of sausages that they were sampling and she was like oh try this and i assumed that they'd baked the sausages like they'd cooked them in the oven 
and then let them to cool. No, no. Literally offering out the samples straight out <laughs> of the uh, oven. Nice. Uh, and well, they, these were literally like 60 or 70 degrees C. Yeah, yeah. Uh, they're piping hot. Literally just like... They they are like you remember those uh, that famous video the the red hot knife that can cut through anything yeah do you remember that that that's what this sausage looked like it was just glowing <laughs> and they just went do you want a piece do you want some have some have it now and they forced their red hot sausage upon me yeah um and you gagged and you tried to hold it back and you just couldn't and then you went to work the next day and people asked you if you were fine. And you, you, you're not fine, mm. but you had to... <laughs> I, can't, I can't do the rest of that meme. I don't, I don't remember how it goes. Yeah. I'm sure I can add it in. <laughs> um, I mean, that was another thing that I had that uh, slowed me down a little bit the other week uh, with video editing is uh, Da Vinci decided it wanted an update and then it wanted to spend every 15 minutes asking me to spend $300 on the full version of Da Vinci. <laughs> Would you like the full version of Da Vinci? We can sell it to you. Yes, we know that you're not using the full version. The full version has this lovely case that the game comes in. Wait, it's not even a game, it's a software package. We have this too. Would you like it? It's only 300 pounds. I like how it even knows what country I'm from, but it's still advertised to me in Dollaroos. Dollaroos? Oh, in wow. red hot Dollaroos. Why am I best attacking the laser eye? Why are, you, why are you attacking from there, though? That's stopping Gort from attacking. I just don't like that. <laughs> what, I you don't want Gort to deal more damage? Well, I think it... A, it puts Arthur in a position where he's not really suited to being. And I think if you actually get behind the laser eye, it can't shoot you. Well, yeah, obviously. It can only go uh, I'm going to stick but... Chris there. Where, and I think if I'd have let... Get any there you go. So if Arthur had attacked from the side, he wouldn't be getting shot right now. <laughs> oh, wait. It was its turn to fire? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I didn't realise that. I was too busy, like, mocking people. Like, okay. Right. Xylo's probably going to die. Another Danny Elfman. Kill it. Nope. We evaded Danny Elfman last time, and now it's his time to dodge us. Everything is going swimmingly. Oh, yeah. You left Chris behind as well. That was a good choice. Yeah. Although she yeah, would have died. She'd have died, yeah. She would have died by the big old lazy eye. Stupid lazy eye. This is the thing that I remember from this fight being annoying, is like, if you just have like one bad turn, or you get caught... Wait, you just... No, you got impatient. You were like, oh, I can do some damage to it now. We've done this like 17 times. So we haven't done it, it 17 way. times. We've done it once. No, it's twice. It's exaggeration, Gareth. Used for comedic effect. No one's laughing, John. Why? Why, Why didn't the archer kill me? That could have been game over, man. Uh, you know what? You're I've got all... Just I've... heal yourself? Yeah, you I've got all... Healer. I've like, got... the only thing Lowe's good at. He's just like, mm, I wonder if I'm carrying any special items. I'm here with my magical... Yes, my magical staff that's used for healing. No, I'm just going to go into my inventory, check my pockets, see if there's a rogue-like lozenge <laughs> around that I can use to heal off of. Gort's dead. Of I course, and, uh, and he got critted. Awesome. Just just what we wanted. Oh, yeah, go forwards. That, that's, the, that's the play, right. is it? I, I can't get far enough back. Yeah, you get, you're going to get healed off someone, though. <laughs> I'm a drink this milk, Mr. T style, as I return. Daki Chan engaged. <laughs> engaged or enraged. Whoa. <laughs> Like he's, he's gotten like another four turns before he hits anything. Yep. See? Like, what are you even worried about? Right. That should kill this guy. Optimistic face. <laughs> 13 points. Yep. 
No more Home Alone music for you, sir. <laughs> no more crying in the bathtub with a shandy. Xylo's <laughs> gonna die. <gasps> Took it like a champ. He like dead. Oh my god! He tapped the what? wrong person. DJ Archer's She's all dead. Drunk. They've gotta be drunk. They've gotta be like, yeah, whatever, mate. We're just here for, for laughs. Bants. I mean, look at that. That's hilarious, that stupid woman. Like, <laughs> the way she's dressed. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm surprised I'm surprised he didn't just leave Xylo out there to deal damage, actually. Because I was hoping something like this would occur. Because <laughs> I want Chris to get to Bowie, to heal Bowie. Yeah, no, I get that. I mean, Bowie's pretty safe there, yeah. so... I mean, it ends, I think, when you kill the Silver Knight at the bottom. And the problem yeah. that's going to happen now is the AI is going to spend all of its time healing the Lazy Eye. Of course Chris can't get there. Of yeah. course she can't. Cannon sequence initiated. The thing that's really annoying with this... That's fine. I'll accept it this time. Is because the lizard man stood to the side where the laser. Yeah, the lizard man's helping out. He's just like, yeah. oh, you want to hit this? I'll just stand here then. That's fine. Yeah. Well, actually, he's in the way because I can't actually surround the laser eye. Just, God damn it, Diane! Uh, what? Why didn't you just put it in front of Tao? But she could have hit the lizard man. Uh, she could have hit the the laser eye. Oh, Xylo gone. No. Unfortunate, sir. Is Tau dead? Is this another perfectly timed crit from the Elfman? Xylo's gonna get hurt a little bit. Yeah, he's gonna be fine. Yeah. Screw it. Oh, yeah, it's the way to go. I mean, you'll deal like five damage. Seven. Oh, seven. That's good. She's killed oh. it. <laughs> there you go, then. May, I take all those horrible things I've said about you for weeks and weeks and weeks now. <laughs> Notice the Silver Knight saw that and he's like... Whoa, okay, okay. Wait. Hang on, hang on. We... We didn't mean any of the nasty things we said before. We, um, we, we've had a change of heart. Uh, we actually, we actually like, uh, all you gnomes all and, uh, oh, elfish oh, people. All hail the Shining Force. I, I, I've yeah, never said yeah, anything yeah. bad about you before. That. I <laughs> yeah. always said that. Um, I, I always thought you guys were the best. You, you yep. gotta come out on top, number one. Shining Force number one. Yep. I was gonna do some weird hand gesture and then I had nothing. I, like, I'm also just gonna drop the control pad if I was to do such a thing. That's better than what I had. I was gonna go with the religion route and I'm like, hmm, that's probably gonna upset some people, so I'm not gonna do that. Why? <laughs> God. Uh, well done, Gav. Well done. Don't act like you've never done such a thing in your War of the God series. Oh, I never did. No, I, no. Was, I was perfect all the Flawless way. all the time. Yep, flawless. That's what they call me. Flawless Woodhouse. That sounds like a really bad property sell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it does. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Just... God. You know what it actually reminds me of? It reminds me of this old house. Jesus. So, uh, Americans might know what this is. Uh, this old house is basically a TV show back in the 90s where um, a guy, like, does up a house. It's like Bye one of those, Tao. like... Bye Town. It was one of those shows where, like, they had, like, a, a woodcutter or some, like, renovator guy yeah. come and basically see if... It's basically Grand Designs before there was Grand Designs. Yeah. I was going to um, say, like, Changing Rooms, wasn't it? It's or is similar. it? Or is it like a thing, full house? It, it was before all of this happened. Like before any of the UK shows happened, there was this one thing. And now, normally, like I, I shouldn't even be able to watch that. But we were one of the first people to have uh, Sky TV. 
in our in our house. Um, we were the first people to get it. In on your house, think, there we go. No, we were. <laughs> I paused and then went in our house because our house had it and nobody else in the street and I think nobody on the block had it apart from us. Not even Jenny? And probably not. Not even Jenny from the block? Oh god, Gareth, well done. <laughs> Jeez. No, um... Anyway, so that... It, Sky was brilliant, by the way. It had, like, instead of the, the rubbishy, the rubbishy, like, um... BBC and ITV... Uh, kids shows we had we had Cartoon Network with its amazing like kids programming that was on all day which is amazing and so my sister and I would run home from school turn on the sky and then realize that the VHS is uh, recording something and what is it recording at the one time where we have control of the TV this, this old, old house. house who was it in your this household that was ruining your life was it your dad? Our father, who, <laughs> who, who is the one who paid the bill for the Sky. Yeah. And when we quizzed him about it, he went, It's my Sky Dish. When you pay for the Sky Dish, you can control what it's on. At which point we went, How much is a Sky Dish? And he went, More than you will ever have until you're 21. <laughs> <laughs> so we were screwed. We couldn't do anything about it. We'd rush home thinking, oh my God, we'd be there at, at, at school telling all our friends like we have this amazing thing, this sky dish. Like, I, the, this was right in the beginning. I, I want sky. you to just see what May did then to this guy. 14 out of 16 HP. Really? She nearly won him? Yeah. That's pretty cool. After we but were yeah. saying how to have Anyway, back to this old house and your dad threatening you with uh, destitution at an early age. Well, yeah, we... No, I mean, it was just... It was an inconvenience. But let's say we had this amazing thing, but we couldn't use it. And, and by the... Like, because our... Rev, our, like, you know... Um, the amount of time that we had to watch things was... It stopped when my dad got home because it's, it's his dish. Yeah. So, like... He was he was totally screwing us over because he'd yeah. be like, "Oh, I'm I'm recording this thing when I'm not here, and then when I get home, I also take control of the television, yeah. which is the only TV that had Sky." So it's just like he was the evil overlord at that point. Enjoy terrestrial TV plebs. Uh, <laughs> we didn't even know that I'd have another TV in the house though, so that was it. Oh dear! When he got home, he got control. But he did used to like watching The Simpsons, so that was cool. Yeah. Uh, you were the villain last week, John, I think. Oh, uh, <clears throat> You may have beaten us here, but General Elliot will stop you in POW! How's he climbing that? He's a horse. Phew! They're, fa they're famously terrible at climbing. <laughs> I thought I was a goner, but I caught a branch and just hung on. A great battle. I don't know who you are, but I want to tag along. Pele joins the Shining Force. He's going to be doing his keepy ups. A good job getting into uh, get into that laser eye. Hurry on to pow. Evil is afoot. All Not right, Holmes, calm down. With the laser eye gone, the Shining Force heads towards the moving town of pow. The moving town. The moving town of pow. Knowing that does Runefa it, it does move. You'll see in a moment. Knowing that Runefaust is gathering its forces, our heroes hurried onward. Pow all over your face. 